my beauties. Are you ready for our reading lesson today? Hey, hey, I know I am because we're going to be reading all about maps. That's right, maps. And our goal for today is we can explain what a map is and how people use it. So you see, I'm in a map right now. Do you know what a map is? Have you seen a map? Well, that's okay if you haven't because today we're going to read all about it. And that is our goal. Know that at the end of this reading, you should be able to talk all about it. All right, let's get it started. On a Map by Karen Jones. Maps show us where to find things. A map is a drawing or picture of a place. A map can be on a piece of paper or on a screen like a tablet or phone. When you look at a map, it is showing you what the place looks like from above. What do you see in the map? Yeah, you might say like it looks like a um, somebody's house, maybe on the top floor and on the bottom floor. You can use a map to help you get somewhere. You find the place that you are in and a place where you want to go. You follow roads, highways, or paths to get to that place. Maps can show us where land, roads, and water are located. Can you tell what part of this map is land and what part is water? Can you find a road? Can you look at that map and see right here? Yeah, if you said the water is probably the, the, the lake, you see that, the roads, we can tell on this map. Maps can tell us where mountains and rivers are. Can you tell where the mountains are? How about the river? Maps can tell us where hospitals, airports, and other important spots are. Can you tell where the airport is? How about the hospitals? What symbol do you see that could tell you kind of where the, the airport is? What about the hospital? What do you notice? Maps are important. They show us where to find places and things. Now, later, you are going to create your own map in Writing Workshop, and then you're going to write all about it, okay? Awesome sauce. So this map shows kind of a person at a house. What types of things do you see in this map? What symbols do you see that can tell you where the things are? All right, y'all. Excellent. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Today's goal was that we were going to be able to explain what a map is and how people use it. So, can you describe what a map is? Do you remember from the book? What do people use a map for? Yeah, they use it to find things. And a map shows us where different things are. It also can show us maybe what it looks like in a home or it where places are like a doctor or a hospital or an airport. It can show us a map of a city or a town or somewhere in nature. Maps are important. They help us get where we need to go. Have you ever seen or used a map? Maybe you may not have a paper map like they did long ago, but if you look in a phone or a tablet, you can find a map. Why don't you try that? You can look on a phone or a tablet and go in that Google Maps and kind of look around. Maybe you can find things that you've never found before. All right, my beauties, I hope you enjoyed this reading today and know that we're going to write about this book later on in our writing workshop. All right, I'll see you later, my beauties. Bye.